Hey what is going on guys and girls, in today's video I'll be showing you how to bypass originality.ai's AI detection score and how to reduce AI detection on any piece of text. First off, we'll be using Claude 2 and I'll be leaving all of the prompts in the description below this video. So I've primed the AI by asking it how do I write a blog post so that it sounds more human and like it was written by a human being. And here are some tips for writing blog posts that sound more human and natural. Use casual conversational language, use contradictions, don't be afraid of using the first person, don't obsess over perfect grammar, and so on. So it gives us a list of um, tips that we can use to help write content that is more human-like. Next, what I asked it to do was keep this list in mind. So I wanted to keep this list in mind. Uh, but also follow the instructions below and this is my custom prompt so it has a couple of different things that the AI can take into account to make sure that it's writing more human-like which will reduce AI detection so again I'm going to leave this prompt in the description below this video but essentially it talks about perplexity I'm writing in burstiness writing in specific ways that contain specific words do not use commas and so on. So here's the blog post. It's a thousand word article on how to become a millionaire. And I've already went ahead and copied over this content and ran the test on originality.ai. And as we can see here, it is 98% original and 2% AI. It is 0% plagiarized and it has a 50 score in terms of readability. So that was the content that we got back from Claude 2. And essentially any content that you write on Claude 2 will be able to bypass AI detectors pretty easily. But when you use these prompts, um, you're able to get a much higher score because sometimes if I were to just tell it to write me an article and do a test on that article, I can get um, 60 or 70% AI um, bypassing. But if I use these prompts, I'm able to get 90 plus um, percent of AI free content. So that's how you bypass AI detection using Claude. Now let's go ahead and talk about how to bypass AI detection using ChatGPT, which is a lot more difficult. The great thing about ChatGPT is that it's recently launched a new feature, which is custom instructions. And you can actually go ahead and prompt the AI a little bit more deeply to be able to bypass AI detection. So for this custom instruction, we've told the AI that we're going to be writing in a way that reduces and bypasses AI detection. And I've went ahead and pasted in that prompt, the same prompt that we use in Claude in the um, second box, which talks about how we would like ChatGPT to respond. So we've saved these instructions and we're going to tell the AI to write us a blog post about how to become a millionaire. So GPT-4 has went ahead and done so. It's a very, very short article um, because they are having some issues currently with GPT-4 and its output. But let's go ahead and see how it does in comparison with Claude 2. So here are the results from GPT-4 using ChatGPT. It is 100% original and 0% AI written. It's been a while since I was able to get 100% original content from ChatGPT, especially since originality.ai has um, upgraded their algorithm. It's a lot harder for you to bypass their AI detectors, but you have to use custom instructions. That's the only way in which you can bypass AI detectors using um, ChatGPT currently. So let's go ahead and we ran the same input on GPT 3.5. That was GPT 4 before. So now let's go ahead and test GPT 3.5 with the custom instructions to see if we are able to get the same results. So when testing GPT 3.5, we're still getting 100% AI written content. It is still 0% original. So this trick, I guess, if you want to call it that, only works on GPT 4. So you're not able to bypass um, originality.ai using GPT 3.5. But again, let's go ahead and do one last test to make sure that this prompt works. So here is the output that we got back from GPT 4 about how to become a lawyer. Now let's go ahead and do a new scan. Boom, boom, boom. Scan now. And again, we get 100% original content, 0% plagiarized, and a score of 79 in terms of readability. So that's really, really good. Um, as you can see here, we are able to bypass AI detection tools like originality.ai using ChatGPT, specifically GPT-4, but you have to use custom instructions. So I'll go ahead and leave those prompts in the description below this video. As always, I hope that you enjoyed today's video. If you did, let it be known by giving us a big thumbs up and subscribing to the channel if you haven't already. Until next time, stay well.